You know that the situation in Guinea has grabbed media's attention, and it's reported that special forces soldiers have attacked the presidential palace and took over the state television, telling the nation that they have dissolved the government and its constitution, and also closed its land and air borders. And they have also announced the establishment of the National Committee for Reconciliation and Development, and urged its citizens to maintain the normal work and life. And during today's Chinese Foreign Ministry's press conference, the spokesperson Wang Wenbin also said that China is closely following the situation in Guinea. Let's take a listen of what he has to say. We are closely following the situation in Guinea. China opposes the coup and calls for an immediate release of President Alpha Conde. We call on and hope all parties can remain calm, bear in mind the fundamental interests of Guinea and its people, resolve relevant issues through dialogue and consultation, and safeguard domestic peace and stability. Well, in light of the military coup attempt in the country, that the Chinese uh, embassy in Guinea have also advised the Chinese nationals to tighten up their personal security and not go out. And the uh, Chinese embassy in Guinea spokesperson Yue Xiaowen also said that after this coup attempt, the Chinese embassy also carried out its work in a steady and also uh, an orderly manner and also to establish uh, the emergency response mechanism immediately.